All right, welcome back to Sun Cricks. Cracks. Sun Cracks, there you go. That's a new way, I haven't said it yet. We're still playing New Game Plus 4. We'll see how this one goes. Uh, I assume, you know, not terribly well, as usual. The New Game Plus 4 is tough. Um, I haven't looked at, like, how well the best players are doing online. I assume many of them have gotten past level 4. You have experience with auto battlers, which I don't. I'm sure that would help. Ooh, really? I think we buy it all, right? Just lock it and buy it over the course of a few turns. A level two item that you get, a level two unit that you get two of this early, and also one other unit that synergizes with it. That seems pretty cool. I mean, Hunter isn't my favorite level 2 unit, but he's, like, fine. Um, the knockback can do quite a lot sometimes to, you know, kind of act like a long-distance silence. If, if an enemy was, like, if a turret was aiming at you or uh, an orange guy was curling up to launch at you, knocking them back a lot can be quite nice. I'm going to keep the archer lock as well. You can't stop me. I guess I could sell something else to buy it. And then get a reroll. Yeah. That seems fair. It doesn't give me a reroll, but it like means I won't have the next level locked, and so uh, I'll kinda get a reroll for free at the beginning of the level. Pretty horrible shot there, Hunter. Alright, I mean, yeah, that wave went fine, of course. When they start introducing the fancier guys is when it gets more exciting. I think they made it through that without a scratch, which is nice. No guarantee of future performance, of course. Let me out. You guys won't catch me. I'm not scared. Oh my god, that ranger shot. That was immense. It, I mean, we didn't need it to be great, but it was great. In that it just clobbered a bunch of individuals very far away, making them bounce into each other. Um, kinetic bomb, I guess? I could go for area size, but it looks like we're kind of picking up rangers so far. Um, an Ouroboros technique might not be insane, but I think it probably is, right? If we're playing with rangers, we want to be running away from guys not getting hit by them. And so Kinetic Bomb is just kind of like a way to get them further away from you when things go badly. Another ranger is great. A merchant is fine, and a witch is fine. These are both just kind of free to pick up at the moment, because we wouldn't get any interest anyway. I could have sold some units to gain interest, but it's too early in the game to... Like, I, I need to be building up my actual damage. I'm not greeting out interest on a... Like, okay, yeah, on this level, I don't need the extra damage. But a couple levels from now, I will, and I don't want to have to pay money to reroll to gain items or units that I could have just bought now. Even though it's eh, costing me a bit of interest, uh, I think it's well worth it. Yeah, that Forcer, the, 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 the Hunter, he's doing way more than I remember Hunter is doing in the past. He really does clear out a big path. Okay, I mean, Miner is great. Swordsman, not so great, but, you know, I'll, I'll grab it, I guess. So now we're going to start getting um, extra money off the floor. Is there anything I want to sell to pick up a swordsman? Like, I mean, I guess I could sell the scout. We don't seem to be going rogues, and we might go warriors. Sure. Actually, maybe we, we might have been, now that I think about it. Well, no, because we have, we have a psych, a vagrant. So there is some benefit to going warriors. I was thinking maybe I should have kept the scout because we might get projectile synergies. 
But, I don't know. Like, we might get warrior synergies too. Hey, don't don't knock him into me. You're supposed to knock them far away. That's that's what the uh, the idea is. Am I hearing dogs? I I'm hearing like dogs barking. That's the hunter, isn't it? That's so bizarre. Okay. Kind of surrounded, I would prefer to not be. Ah, we, we finally have we have three rangers now, which which is why we're getting so many more uh oh, get away from there. So many more arrows being fired. And we're getting the barrages going off. Yeah, minor like the, the mercenary synergy still doubled the amount of money I got that that level. They're, they're just so insane. Uh... I think I should take the Flagellant. Like, that's that's who... Like, I, I, I don't know. I, I titled the last episode Flagellant Carry? Kind of like clickbaity reasons. I don't know if he was actually all that amazing. Um, but I think he was pretty okay. I don't know. I'll take a Carver. They're bad, but I get the Psycho Synergy and the Healer Synergy. Which might help a little. I should put the Vagrant in front. Whoops. Uh, okay. Just awful driving. Absolutely inexcusable performance there. I don't know who I lost. Hopefully nobody too important. Oh, well, here's my Carver area. Ow. Yeah. I think that... Starting this level off by throwing away one of my units was maybe not the best plan. You know what? I don't need the gold as much as I need some healing. This the Carver healing thing just really sucks. Please? No, I'm gonna lose. damage left, I think. Who do I even have? A Cleric, a Carver, and a... my Vagrant. Well, there goes the... Carver, I guess? Well, it's not impossible for a Cleric and a Vagrant to clear out. Oh, no. Now it's just a Carver. Okay, alright. Let's run that one back. I thought it was going pretty okay, but I guess it was not. I don't know, maybe it was and I just like... The whole thing fell apart because I piloted the snake right into the spawner on the first section. It was pretty horrible driving. Does the dual cutter's projectile move faster than the arcanist's projectile? Oh wow, we're already up to ranger synergy, okay. That's nice and early. Like obviously the, the slow moving blue circle is slow. I think the, the, the shots that it shoots are just as fast as the ranger shots though. Damage is absolutely stellar for level 2. The, the range of synergy helps, of course. I'll take a merchant, and I guess another arcanist wouldn't be bad?
Not much to worry about this this early, I think. Our damage is still fine. Although it doesn't seem as stellar as it did last level. I guess we've disam dismantled this wave with no concern at all. So maybe it is fine. Okay, try and... Oh, try and kill the green guy later, not right now, if you could be so kind. Oh! Okay, I think we're gonna be okay here. Ow. Yeah, this looks fine. I mean, none of this does anything, really. Kinetic bomb we had last time, I guess it was okay. Fine. Kept me alive for a lot longer on a level where I was going to die anyway. Garager is nice. And I'm not gonna sell like both arcanists to get one interest, am I? Maybe I am. Cause that's like it's one interest, but it sort of compounds, so I'll have like I'll have like three gold more. Which means I'll almost be earning one interest per level. Maybe I should be working more on I don't know. I feel like I'm, if I do this I'll die on level six, but I don't know how much having these guys is really gonna help. It's not really gonna compound, because I'm just gonna spend it all as fast as I can. I think I should just buy some more units to try to live through uh level 6. I wouldn't mind passing for interest, but I think selling units back for interest is... and and, and then not buying any others is like a pretty huge investment that I'm not excited to make. Oh, my barrager is making guys knock, uh, get knocked back on occasion. That's true. Um, whoops. Oh, yeah. Oh, whoops. I came back at the wrong angle there. I had the right idea, but I bounced off the wall wrong. Um, I mean, I have a sorcerer. And we love projectiles? Question mark? So buy all this? I don't know. Well, the Arcanist and Illusionist should do quite a bit of damage, I think. Yeah, I would love some projectile items. That's what I want, really. Um, yep, yeah, it's bad. Bad driving? Don't kill me? I could use a cleric, but I don't know, it's not really the most important thing. And we did pretty well on that level, I think. Hmm. Well... I want the archer, but I also want my one interest. I could sell back, like, the Magician? It, it's sad because it reduces my damage output on the Elite Wave, but I, I think my damage is okay. So just try and concentrate me more into the units I have synergies for. It, I know it strictly decreases my damage for this level, but I, I want to be able to upgrade my Archer? Was it the Archer in spot? I've already forgotten. Whoever it is, I want to be able to upgrade him sooner, rather than be able to somehow branch out into mages. Um, bad? Bad? Get away? I got cornered again. Well, I got cornered and then lost a bunch of units again. No! Stop! God, I hate this guy. I remember on like New Game Plus 1 or 2, he was kind of a joke. But he's like a real challenge on Plus 4. 
Okay, being able to send them away was really nice. Ah, God, <laughs> he bounced back into me. Please, oh, I'm gonna lose again. Oh my God, I've lost again. Okay, one more go, one more go. Fine. It's a pretty horrible start. I'm sure better driving could have saved me on that last one, for sure. Um, I don't. I, I think that the the snake was strong enough to win. I just like got trapped somehow a couple too many times. Um, you know, arguably it could be said that it was caused by not doing damage fast enough, and maybe having that magician would have been enough. I don't know. Oh my god. We can pick up a miner already. It's amazing. I'm gonna have to go through a level with just a scout and gold for damage dealing. But soon, I will earn dividends. Yes! Go, scout, go! You got this! Look at you! What a champ! I'm not picking up that gold until there's more enemies on the screen that I want to kill quickly. Red guys? You know, no, we're not wasting gold on you. If, if anything green or white shows up, yeah, I'll, I'll pick up the gold. You know what? I want to make sure I, I... I do want to make sure I get it all, of course, right? But I don't want to waste it. It's very mild damage potential. There we go. Well, this one green guy literally could kill us, I think. Yeah, like that. that. That's what could happen that could cause us to die, but more so. Alright, so I think we got just two gold out of the scout, or the miners, the mercenaries, but, you know, that's four instead of two, right? Yeah, amazing. Now I can buy all of this. What, a, what an improvement. Sort of. We didn't get much more actual damage, but the sage hopefully gives us a little extra control. Of some kind? Which leads to taking less damage. Right? Any minute now, Sage? There you go. Boy, the miner... These seeking bits of gold are just... They're even worse than they sound. They don't hit anything ever. And when they do, they don't do any damage. It's really quite remarkable. So we've gotten three extra gold already, I think. And we've taken no damage. Barely. It's been a bit of a close thing on occasion. And we're clearly not doing much damage ourselves. But that's not what this is about. It's about just barely skating by long enough to grind out merchant bonuses so that I can finally start doing damage. Yeah, as you can see, we're like not very strong at the moment, but we're strong enough. What do we get, like five extra? Four extra? Oh. Um... I mean, all of this kind of doesn't do anything yet. Wait, what? They changed... no. Why is this reroll free? Uh, I have no idea. But I don't really want any of these. They could do something eventually, but right now they don't. I mean, I guess I don't even know what I'm trying to go for, so maybe I should just take something decent. Um, Reinforce and Unrelenting Stance both can be good, so I assume can Whispers of Doom, if you have a ton of 
cursors who can repeat their attacks often. Um, but I think Unrelenting Stance is, of these, the one that can like actually just win you the run, eventually. So I guess I'll take it. I don't know what's up with this free reroll. Is it just like sometimes free without anything weird going on? I mean, we happen to hit that chance, or, or what? Anyway, I'm... It costs me two interest to buy something here, because we lose the, the normal interest and the merchant. But I clearly need more dudes, right? So we'll just buy everything and figure it out later. And getting the scout upgrade is a, a nice bonus. But we're, we're in no shape to make it through level 6, by the way. Get out of there! That's where the sage is putting them. I like that it makes noise when it drops gold. I don't know if it always did that. It did... It's not like this is the first time it's ever happened. It, it had... It's done that for at least a couple updates, but I don't know if it was in, like, the first Mercenary update. Uh, I mean, Vagrant Sorori here. I could sell some stuff to get extra interest instead of buying these, but I think instead I'll buy them. And we get our first gold from the merchant. Well, the first interest from the merchant. He's been giving us gold every level by working together with the miner. Oh my god, it's a white dude. Um, oh, we got him. Nice shot, uh, whoever that was. Vagrant, maybe? Yeah, I mean, I, it's kind of cool when they're all clumped up, but it's not, like, amazing. Did I get a cleric? I think I did, right? Maybe I should be taking more hits with my Vagrant to uh, try and gain defense. Wow, Vagrant levels up, huh? And I can pick up a Hunter for... A ranger synergy? I mean, that might actually be what I need to survive. That's pretty optimistic, honestly. But we'll see what we can do. If I die here a third time, we're, we're ending the episode. Not out of defeat, but just like I don't want to start a new run at this stage when a run that's successful can take me like an hour. Uh, what am I doing? Get out of there? Try to get the Vagrant to take the hits when you can. Okay, suck him in there, Sage. You can do it. You can do it. It's going okay. There's gold on the ground. Okay, that was maybe a little greedy. <laughs> to drive in there just for that one gold. Ah. But I kind of believed we had won the combat, and I still do believe that. Okay, made it made it past level 6, finally. Gold? If there's gold, you have to give it to me. There you go. I mean, I have a mage, so that would at least do something. Fine. Maybe I'll end up having more, who knows? This re this reroll costs eight. Okay. Um, I could consider actually rerolling. Like, we seem to be going in a ranger direction, and I've gotten a bunch of extra money that I should use to improve my my chances somehow or other. And I don't want to use it for rerolls right now, but I think. Going for an item that looks good is worth a try. Gold coins are attracted to the snake. <laughs> I 
I feel like I can usually manage to just pick them up, but I guess I've like kind of killed myself going after those a few times. It's it's a possibility. Um, rogues crit better? We currently only have one rogue. And we only have one sorcerer as well, right? But this could do something. I'm gonna I'm gonna take assassination, I think. I don't know. Let's let's just try magnetism. It seems horrible, but at least at the moment it does something, which I can't say for the other two. Okay, a nice pickup. Anything I want to sell? I could sell my merchant. I don't particularly care about him leveling up, and I want the extra interest. Sell one merchant, obviously, not both, as you saw. I haven't seen any gold coins yet. I demand my gold coins, please? There's one. It's not moving towards me. Okay, you have to get pretty close still, but you don't have to go right over it. I would have expected that for an entire item, they would let it come to you from anywhere. Like, that's a big investment, to spend an item slot on that. But okay, I mean, there's obviously there's some advantage to it not seeking you from far away, which is that you can choose when to pick it up for minor reasons. But that seems pretty uh, minor. So yeah, this item seems dreadful. Can I sell this, please? <laughs> Sadly, no. Um, we could pick up a warrior. Or we could... Well, we didn't end up picking up the rogue stuff or any mage stuff. So, you know, let's go with this. And um, try to get a warrior synergy going. Warriors and rangers, maybe. I could sell something to pick up a spell blade if I wanted. The sage? I guess he's okay. I'm gonna sell the sorcerer. Um, the mage synergy is something that helps every unit, whereas the sorcerer synergy only helps sorcerers. And this also has a rogue attached to it as well, even though I kind of hate the specific knife attack that he does. It seems really hard to get it to hit stuff. Or to hit anything in particular. Obviously it just like, hits stuff at random somewhat regularly, I guess? You guys like how good I am at dodging those blue things, by the way? Sometimes I'm good. Sometimes I'm horrible. Yeah, take that, Vagrant. Just eat up all the damage, please, and hope the Cleric takes care of you. I don't want the Cleric's time to be wasted, you know? I want to make sure there's always someone at 50 or less health. I heard some gold. I guess I must have picked it up already. Okay. Um, what about a Plague Doctor? We could get a second Nuker. It's not that amazing. Also not amazing are my items. Um, you know what? I have a ton of money. I should upgrade this. Going into a hard wave. There you go. And I may as well... I'm at 11 now, so if I want any new units, I do have to sell one. I don't really want to do that. I don't think. Every one I have is pretty cool. The scout's not doing much, neither is the warrior, but if I can get another synergy for either of them, 
And actually, I mean, the Swordsman is, right? I, I just upgraded Unrelenting Stance, so... The question is, like, you know, what would I what would I sell to, to buy this guy? 13 damage a second is pretty cool, and he shoots out a lot of these things. I feel like I should find room for him somehow. Maybe that's by getting rid of the... The Sage? But then I'm also losing my Forcer, which I think is affecting the Hunter? Yeah. So I could throw out the Spellblade, who I just bought. Not that that should be a huge influence, of course. I think that's the only reasonable thing I could sell, actually. Or the Sage. Yeah, I don't think the Forcer Synergy is doing that much for me. Let's throw out the... The Sage or the Spellblade. One of those two. I think grouping enemies up is really good. Let's throw away the Spellblade. He's not doing much for me. And I can buy these guys, I guess, for free and sell them back if I want. Well, that, that guy is the one I can fit. Don't, don't shoot me. I'll make you regret it, buddy. I hope. Okay, I heard some gold. Oh, I should be getting... I should be grinding up for defense. There you go. Okay, don't, don't kill the Vagrant, though. That's, that's an important part of the plan is that you don't just kill your units for no reason. <laughs> Believe it or not, that's not... That's a thing they write in the strategy guides. Don't don't kill your units for no reason. Ooh, ow. Alright, we should be okay in this last wave, I hope? It's actually not so clear. Oh my god, there's more? Shitting me? <laughs> okay, that'll do, I guess. Level nine. All right. I just like those. <laughs> I can't even words, man. So many of those turrets all at once, and I I ran away from them instead of towards them. I don't know. I can blame myself a little for that. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.